All right, so I watched another 80s movie last night. I watched Without Warning. And uh, the poster here kind of gives the game away, but you know what? It's a cool poster. Uh, anyway, this movie, it is a cheese fest. It is a cheese fest. This is one of those classic 80s horror movies where all like the actors are like way over the top. Right, they're all weirdos, they all overact, and they, like, so anyway, so there's an alien who's, like, hunting humans in, like, this park or something, like, you know, like a, like a forest, right, um, and so, like, the opening shot is just, like, a bunch of their first victims, and then, like, a group of kids, because it's always a group of, like, fucking, like, 19-year-olds or whatever, 18-year-olds, right, they go out, you know, to, like, camp for whatever, and, um, Honestly, this movie, again, it was so cheesy, but it's that really good kind of cheesy. The cheesy that when you laugh at it, it just makes you enjoy the movie more. And when, like, when you don't laugh, when you're just thinking, oh, this is kind of cool, right? Like, it's just a good movie. Like, I love cheesy movies. You know, I don't, a lot of people, they don't like cheesy movies, in my opinion. I think they have a low IQ. Um, but anyway, so the, the, the kids go out there, two of them, there's, you know, two boys, two girls, whoa, right? And then two of them are trying to fuck on the beach or something or this lake. And then the alien kills them. And then the other two are looking for them. And then they find their dead bodies in a shack, right? And that's where they fight and run away from the alien. They go to a bar. And then there's, like, this guy with PTSD from Vietnam or something who, like, who has seen the aliens and believes in them. But he's also got PTSD. Um, is there booba in this movie? Yes. There's, uh, there's plenty of titty scenes. Uh, especially, like, if you like dead bitches if you're a necrophile you'll love this movie because there's a dead bitch hanging on the thing and you, you know there's right there anyway so anyway so this sarge guy he's like a vietnam vet he's got ptsd and he's kind of nutso right then he like is starting to try to hunt down the kids that are working with another guy trying to kill the aliens because he's fucking crazy but then he meets the alien and then the final scene where they're trying to blow up the alien with the fucking vietnam vet guy that was fun um, I mean, like, this movie, again, it's a cheese fest. It's, it's a really cheesy fucking movie. Um, and it's good. I like it. This is my kind of shit. I love cheesy movies. 80s movies with the cheese, they, they hit different. They hit different. 80s cheese movies, man. Holy fucking crap. They're just like, I don't know, man. Like, the 80s, I guess, was a time period where, like, anyone could start making movies. Like, there was, like, more and more people were able to make movies with less and less, like, uh, skill, I guess, and it produces this amazing, this amazing result, such as without warning. Uh, there's a lot of scenes where it's, like, from the alien POV, POV, uh, point of view. Like, so the alien is in the bush, like, looking at the humans running around. That's kind of cool, right? And it's just, like, it's a good, it's a good movie. I enjoyed it. I had fun without warning. If it sounds good to you, check it the fuck out.